Hello and welcome to another installation of Motivating Moments. I am Pastor Gary Bush, delighted that you've taken this opportunity to get a two-minute power shot from the Word of the Lord. Here in the month of March, we're dealing with this theme, What the Lord Requires. And we found that theme in the book of Micah, the sixth chapter and the eighth verse. And it reads, it says, He hath showed thee, O man, what is good and what doth the Lord require of thee, but to do justly and to love mercy and to walk humbly with thy God. And so in a nutshell, the Lord has told us what he requires of us. It's not a game of hide and seek. It's not match game where you got to put the pieces together and figure out what the message is. The message here is clear and concise. The Lord requires something of you. He has shown it to you. And then he told you plainly what it was. Three things. He said you have to do justly. You have to love mercy and walk humbly with God. And I only want to deal with do justly. Do justly means be fair. Be fair in all your dealings. Uh, the Bible says that a false weight and a false balance is an abomination to the Lord. The Lord doesn't like cheaters. He doesn't like con men. He doesn't like people who play the shell game to take your money away. He is very interested that you are honest, that you are open, that you're transparent in your dealings, not just with each other, but your dealings with God, because we can't hide anything from him anyway. So do justly, be fair. Uh, you know, I had a lot of sisters and brothers and uh, my parents always told us to divide something, but they came up with a great remedy, great remedy for it. The person that divided it, the other person got the first choice. So it was an incentive to divide it fairly so that everybody was uh, well taken care of. And that's what the Lord requires of us. We have to be fair with God. We have to be fair with our neighbors. We have to be fair with ourselves. You gotta do justly. Just means with equity. It means with a sense of right and a sense of righteousness. And so I wanna encourage you this week in all your dealings and all your conversations, uh, be fair, be just, be honest. And in so doing, you'll be pleasing to the Lord. As always, I'm Pastor Gary Bush. Have a wonderful week. I'll see you next week.